Hey? Give me my wallet. I'm really getting pulled over by a tank right now. Yes, sir. You know, the Supreme Court actually ruled that you're legally allowed to flick off police officers. Okay. That's not what we're talking to you about. We're going to talk to you about it. Do you have your license? Who's on it? Signal 10? Not this? Okay. You got my wallet? Let's step back here between the headlights, please. Wow. You don't have to show him your ID. Yeah. Yes, she does. Come over here. Stand right here between the headlights, please. Mr. Jewell, please no. stand between the headlights. I'm getting... Stand between the yes, headlights yes, where sir. I told you yes, to. Yes, if I have to ask you again, yes, you will be put in handcuffs and arrested yes, for sir. resisting. You do you understand yes, me? Sir. Look at me. Do you understand me? I will comply. Me? Thank you. Yes, sir. Now, Mr. Jewell, the reason yes, that you're sir. being stopped is for improper hand signal, which I I don't know anything about a Supreme Court ruling that you can flick a cop off. What I do know about that extending your arm out the driver's side window My of a vehicle and flicking somebody off is an improper hand signal. There are legitimate hand signals to use. I wasn't trying to see. Stop, stop. Yes, I'm not sir. done, okay? There's legitimate hand signals to use when you're driving. Yes, sir. That's fine. All right. Yes, sir. That's why you're being stopped. The other reason that you're being stopped is because it appeared that the young lady was giving you fellatio while you were driving. So we're going to investigate that and we're going to address these issues. And if it's not an issue, then we'll be on our way. But that's what we're investigating. She was sleeping. And if whenever we drove by, y'all have open air. Uh, one of the dudes who was in a car next to us said, oh, that girl's fucked up. Because he saw her laying down. I I'm, I will swear on God that she wasn't doing that. Okay. Especially in such a high traffic area. Well, that's uh, definitely I what was, it appeared to be. So that's see, why you're being stopped For me, today. I was recently on the ballot uh, for city commission here in Gainesville. Okay. And I was surprised because I thought this was a safe community. That we needed tanks to drive down our streets. I, I mean, I thought that we basically... Uh, you know, I thought this was a safe community. I didn't know we were in Iraq. I'm an, I'm a Navy veteran, by the way. Um, so that's why I was so surprised to see a tank drive down my own neighborhood street. I mean, I'm, that's my big issue. Address, sir? Yes, sir. I mean, no disrespect. Can you arrive further on a single 28 for GPD? Sir, I can I can tell you a million percent. I don't think I don't think a tank should be driving down my neighborhood streets. That's an armored vehicle. That's not a tank. You're telling me this isn't a tank. You were in the navy. Yeah. And you think that's a tank? You tell me this something like this doesn't go to Iraq? Film after your video. You think that's a tank? They're telling me that this right here is not a tank. He, he told me to do that. He told me to do that. It's called an armored personnel carrier. It's called a what? Armored personnel carrier. And I'm going to tell you what. It's basically a tank. I don't mind you recording that, but you're not going to point it at me, at me because there are firearms, or okay. firearms that are made at devices like that. Is, so if you want to film all of us, I don't mind that. We'll set your camera up where it can film all of us. Yes, sir. All right? You want to sit it right here? Um, and it'll face this way where we're all talking. Can I just point it at me? That's fine. Okay. Okay. I can I can swear on to anything. Put me on a polygraph. Wasn't wasn't knowing giving anyone road head. I'll tell you that. I know that's what he said. Come on. Was she moving? She was she was sleeping there. 
Oh my god. That's so ridiculous. Carol. They think you are giving me roadhead. So fucking ridiculous. Do you see my pants? I don't even have a boner. Like, <laughs> like I'm, I'm literally flaccid right now. I mean, <laughs> this is ridiculous. How long were you in the Navy? Three years. Air traffic control. I'm, I'm honestly in shock right now. One, that there's a tank in my neighborhood. University. So I'm, I'm one surprised that a tank is required in my neighborhood, which I thought was a safe place. Uh, and two, that I would be accused of something so lewd and lascivious. My feelings, my feelings were directed towards this vehicle. Okay. You know that vehicle saved multiple lives in the county you live? Saved lives. Yeah. yeah. How so? The bullet in fact on the other side is right there. How, how has this saved lives? We didn't, we didn't get shot. shot. That's how it saved our lives. You were shot on university? Yeah. Like where yeah. civilized people live? Yeah. I'm just telling you that it stopped bullets from killing people. So that's how it saved our lives. I think it's more like a show of force. It looks like a show of force to me. So when somebody decides to go to cricket out of control with a firearm at a UF football game where there's hundreds of thousands of people, and y'all got snipers. If you're in the Navy, come on, brother. Like y'all don't have a sniper. Yeah. Really? Yeah. We can go back to my. Take pictures of this! You're recording. I need a good angle. My good side. I'm I'm literally in shock that I got pulled over by a tank. I was in shock when I saw what appeared to be you getting dead and being going up. Come on, bro. Me and you both know that's not what was happening. Now you're telling me I'm lying. I'm not saying you're lying. I'm saying you know that didn't happen. The guy who has the mindset to flick off the wall driving down the road telling me that I'm lying. Man, this is so ridiculous. I understand y'all could be offended that someone could not like the fact. What statue? Oh, you know that's what it happened. You know that's ridiculous. Well, folks, welcome to America. You, uh, drive down the road, you see a tank, and then this tank pulls you over and claims that you are performing a sexual act. This is insane. This is what it's come to. This is America. This is disturbing. Really. And in the, in the safe community of Gainesville, Florida, the safe college town of Gainesville, Florida, we have a tank, or as they refer to as an armed personnel carrier, and they need to pull me over for an alleged sexual act. This is insane. And actually, I, I wish that I could go back right now and find the gentleman that were walking beside us that said, oh dang, she's fucked up because she would look like she was sleeping next to me and I told her she said that. I told her they said that and uh, we laughed about it. So before they try to accuse me of anything ridiculous, you know, I guess this is sometimes what the police have to do. Whenever you haven't committed a legitimate crime, they have to uh, accuse you of crimes. You know, this is ridiculous. I just got pulled over by a tank. I'm still in shock. I don't know what to think.
Tell me what a police state looks like. This is what a police state looks like. Tell me what a police state looks like. This is what a police state looks like. Tell me what a police state looks like. This is what a police state looks like. Y'all paid by the hour, huh? It's overtime, something, right? Y'all working an extra shift? Making some extra money? Yeah, they're filming. Thank you. Thank you. Tell me what a police state looks like. This is what a police state looks like. How you doing, sir? Not too bad, sir. How are you? Very good. How you doing, thanks? Good. So do you want me to tell you what happened? I really don't care. Okay. All right. Have you ever seen a, a tank pull someone over? Yeah. Really? <laughs> this is my first time uh, seeing this. We got a couple of couple of cameras here to make sure everything's above board. So. You're in the Navy? Yeah. What's your rate? Uh, MA? What? D5. You're an MA though? Yeah. What were you? Uh, AW. AW? That's cool. I was an AC. Oh, really? Yeah. Are they gonna arrest me? I don't know, man. I don't know what they got. I just came here because this is also our job. Okay. Uh, 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 so you got the tag? Sir, what? Here? Yes, sir. Right, here's the deal. I saw some names from the Alaska County Sheriff's Office, okay. so you know. Left hand out the window while you're operating a motor vehicle on a public roadway, particularly with your middle finger up in the air, directed at anybody, that's considered an improper hand signal. Hey. You're not going to be cited for that, but you are going to be issued a warning. When you're yes, driving sir. a motor vehicle on a public roadway, what do you need to be focused on? The road. All right, which is straight ahead of you, right? Yes, sir. Not off to your side with one hand on the wheel and your other hand out the window. Yes, sir. Focusing on over here. That's yes, unsafe driving habit. Would you agree? Uh, yes, sir. Yes. The answer is yes. yes sir. It's also not good for a female passenger to have her head in your lap. Whether you say she's asleep, she says she's asleep, whatever it is, for everybody in this vehicle, it looked like something else. It looked like a sexual act on a public roadway occurring on a driver who's operating a motor vehicle. Does that make sense? Well, it doesn't. It, that's the part that honestly makes the least amount of sense to me because that's so clearly what was not happening. She was okay. still not moving, and uh, I, I can understand how her laying there could be perceived as unsafe, but uh, the implication how of How is the, that passenger supposed to be seatbelted into the front seat? She was seatbelted into the front seat. I'm asking you how she's supposed to be seated in the front seat. Oh, uh, po upright, possibly. I, I, the, the seat look, appears as if it's designed to be for the rider to sit upright. There you go. You're so, on the right track. I, I, Here's what's going to happen picking today. Picking out what you're doing. The report's going to be pulled over, pulled by ASO, the state's yes, receiver stop for the following reasons. A, improper driving issues. Yes, sir. Sticking your hand out the window, one hand on the wheel, looking opposite direction while you're going this way. Yes, sir. On a heavily congested roadway, right after a Gator football game. Right. All right. Do you have any other questions that I can answer for you? No, sir. It's also going to be documented that it appeared you were in the middle of a sexual act. However, we're not filing charges on that, but that is part of the reason you would stop, because that's what it looked like to everybody in this vehicle. Okay. All right? Any questions? No, sir. All right. You have a good day, man. Good stuff, We're good. Right. How you doing?
I can I can tell you a million percent. I don't, to serve out. You're just us off. I don't think I don't think a tank should be driving down my neighborhood streets. That's an armored vehicle. That's not a tank. You're telling me this isn't a tank. You were in the navy. Yeah. And you think that's a tank? You tell me this something like this doesn't go to Iraq? Film that for your video. You think that's a tank? They're telling me that this right here is not a tank. He, he told me to do that. He told me to do that. It's called an armored personnel carrier. It's called a what? Armored personnel carrier. And I'm going to tell you what. It's basically a tank. I don't mind you recording that, but you're not going to point it at me, at me because there are firearms, or okay. firearms that are made at devices like that. Listen. So if you want to film all of us, I don't mind that. We'll set your camera up where it can film all of us. Yes, sir. All right? You want to sit it right here? Um, and it'll face this way where we're all talking. Can I just point it at me? That's fine. Okay. You're not going to point it at me, that's the same thing. Okay. I can, I can swear on to anything. Put me on a polygraph. Yeah. Wasn't, wasn't no one giving anyone roadhead. I'll that's tell you that. Right. I know that's what he said. That's what all of us said. Come on. Was she moving? She was, she was sleeping there. Oh my god. That's so ridiculous. Carol. They think you are giving me roadhead. So fucking ridiculous. Do you see my pants? I don't even have a boner. Like, <laughs> like I'm, I'm literally flaccid right now. I mean, <laughs> this is ridiculous. Good angle. My good side. I'm I'm literally in shock that I got pulled over by a tank. I was in shock when I saw what appeared to be you getting dead and being going up. Come on, bro. Me and you both know that's not what was happening. Now you're telling me I'm lying. I'm not saying you're lying. I'm saying you know that didn't happen. The guy who had the mindset to flick off the wall driving down the road told me that I'm lying. Okay. Man, this is so ridiculous. I understand y'all could be offended that someone could not like the fact. What statue? Oh, you know that's what it happened. You know that's ridiculous. Well, folks, welcome to America. You, uh, drive down the road, you see a tank, and then this tank pulls you over and claims that you are performing a sexual act. This is insane. This is what it's come to. This is America. This is disturbing. Really. And in the, in the safe community of Gainesville, Florida, the safe college town of Gainesville, Florida, we have a tank, or as they refer to as an armed personnel carrier, and they need to pull me over for an alleged sexual act. This is insane. And actually, I a window of a vehicle, and flicking somebody off is an improper hand signal. There are legitimate hand signals to use. I wasn't trying to see. Stop, stop. I'm yes, not sir. done, okay? There's legitimate hand signals to use when you're driving. Yes, sir. That's fine. All right? Yes, sir. That's why you're being stopped. The other reason that you're being stopped is because it appeared that the young lady was giving you fellatio while you were driving. So we're going to investigate that, and we're going to address these issues. And if it's not an issue, then we'll be on our way. But that's what we're investigating. She was sleeping, and if whenever we drove by, y'all have open air. Uh, one of the dudes who was in a car next to us said, oh, that girl's fucked up. Because he saw her laying down. I I'm I will swear on God that she wasn't doing that, okay. especially in such a high traffic area. Well that's uh, definitely I what was, it appeared to be. So that's see, why you're being stopped. For me, today. I was recently on the ballot uh, for city commission here in Gainesville okay. and I was surprised because I thought this was a safe community that we needed tanks to drive down our streets. I I mean I thought that we basically uh, you know, I thought this was a safe community. I didn't know we were in Iraq. I'm an, I'm a Navy veteran, by the way. Um, so that's why I was so surprised 
to see a tank drive down my own neighborhood street. I mean, I'm, that's my big issue. Address, sir? Yes, sir. I mean, no disrespect. Sir. Really? Give me my wallet. I'm really getting pulled over by a tank right now. Yes, sir. You know, the Supreme Court actually ruled that you're legally allowed to flick off police officers. Okay. That's not what we're talking to you about. We're going to talk to you about it. Do you have your license? Who's on it? Signal 10? Not this? Okay. You got my wallet? Let's step back here between the headlights, please. Wow. You don't have to show him your ID. Yeah. Yes, she does. Come over here. Stand right here between the headlights, please. Mr. Jewell, please no. stand between the headlights. I'm getting... Stand between the yes, headlights yes, where sir. I told you yes, to. Yes, if I have to ask you again, yes, you will be put in handcuffs and arrested yes, for sir. resisting. You do you understand yes, me? Sir. Look at me. Do you understand me? I will comply. Me? Thank you. Yes, sir. Now, Mr. Jewell, the reason yes, that you're sir. being stopped is for improper hand signal, which I I don't know anything about a Supreme Court ruling that you can flick a cop off. What I do know about that extending your arm out the driver's side. Three years. Air traffic control. I'm I'm honestly in shock right now. One that there's a tank in my neighborhood. So I'm, I'm one surprised that a tank is required in my neighborhood, which I thought was a safe place. Uh, and two, that I would be accused of something so lewd and lascivious. My feelings my feelings were directed towards this vehicle. Save lives. Yeah, yeah. How so? How has this saved lives? We didn't get shot. That's how it saved yeah, our lives. You were shot on university? Yeah. Like where civilized people live? Yeah, I'm just telling you that it stopped bullets from killing them. So that's how it saved our lives. I think it's more like a show of force. It looks like a show of force to me. Y'all got snipers. Come on, like y'all don't have a sniper. Yeah. Yeah. We can go back to my... Take pictures of this! I need a good...